beautifuls, welcome back to my Chanel. Oh no, oh, she didn't no. join in. She was no. very spooked to the pageant. No, oh. it's, 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 it's. She's not reading the paper. Oh. I'm definitely dead. <laughs> <laughs> I read the Daily Mail! Well, I read the Daily Mail! The I was like, love mail. So, my lovelies, welcome back to another episode of What on Earth Was This the Weirdest Reality TV Show? I seem to be saying that about every everything. single episode. <laughs> everything that I watch, I'm like, this is the weirdest. Maybe actually, that was just what the genre was. Yeah, weird that was from start weird. to finish. Today, we are watching another episode of Pete's PA! Oh, oh. Pete's PA! Pete's PA! PA. <laughs> What I'm trying to say, my loves, is today we're watching episode three of Pete's PA, Pete's PA. the weirdest reality TV competition show in which, at the end of it, they become... Pete's Burns, Pete, Prince Pete Burns Albert. Is, yeah, Pete's Prince Albert, yes. Yeah. Ew, Michelle. Each of this episode oh, that we watch is just completely nonsensical. insane. Yeah, they... No logical explanation for any of this show, so let's just die right in, I can't... Oh! Uh, what's up? Oh, oh. Naughty mummy. Is your eye like? I'm so upset. Funny about what he itchy. Itchy goes. I love mischief. What's that going to do with my legs? Yes. No chance. Oh, kiss me, girls, in the limousine. PA. The P stands for petals. I'm going to put myself forward. Doesn't necessarily mean. Oh, she died last time. She died. She just didn't seem that ambitious. She didn't seem like she really wanted to be here. Kelly just voted herself out. I was a bit I don't know what's happening. happening. A, a P, P to PA. Hey, hey. You can just see it. It made it really real today. It made it real. It made it real. real. It made it real that I'm going to win the chance to be an assistant. Yeah. It's Here we go, Big Brother. And celebrity PA Donna Cooling arrives at the house. It's a very Trini and Susanna skirt. Daytime. I love that she's like a house as well. It's not even like this. It's just it's, a house on a street. Yeah, Isn't that weird? It's, yes, it's quite a big house, but it's not like. It's not like a set. It's not like a set house. Like, it's just like, here's just someone's dad. Who's this coming into my home? Aubergines. We're going to stay in Guildford yeah. this week. Hello. Because they'll have neighbours being like, what is going on? What's Pete yeah. Burns What's doing over there in that dress? Yes. When Donna arrived in the morning, there were still people asleep and hadn't, well, they weren't, weren't ready yet, so she went basically straight upstairs to uh, Look at those beds. sort them out. It's time to be downstairs, ready to go. Ten yeah. minutes. Got ten minutes. I want to see you downstairs, ready to go. Oh. Hello. Hi. What's Good happening? Morning. Yeah. Jolly good. Lucky oh you. Oh my god. I wish I had Why? one. Ten minutes downstairs, ready to go, Dad. Why? I couldn't believe it. Donna walked in. Why? And I... This is the weirdest. Why are you doing Why that? Why have they brought in some assistant already, like one of the judges, but hello, time for you to get up and go. No. Point. The whole point of this is to be like, would they be a good PA? So telling them to do things are ridiculous, like if they don't show up, right, you've lost them. It still seems to me like they saw, the producer saw Pete Burns on Big Brother and was like, we need to recreate this because yeah. this was, everyone was talking about Pete Burns in Big Brother. He was the most fascinating character. Yes, yes. Apart from the, the gag of Chantel actually not being a celebrity. And what was it? Cotton Candy. It was Candy Floss. Candy, candy Floss. Floss with the K. Yeah, that one. Oh God, yeah. She didn't know her own song. Yeah, she was like. <laughs> knew that she wasn't a celebrity I'm like uh, well to be honest uh, around the time like tat was famous yeah, wasn't it let's I be honest want it all. I couldn't name if I was to go into a, like I don't know celebrity love island does big brother I'm a celebrity get me gout oh. I would be like I'd be like I don't know who any of these people no, are no, <laughs> so they true. could all be famous or yeah, not you know weird isn't it 10 minutes later and the wannabe PAs have managed to get to the front room to meet with Donna fashion and styling is an important part of Pete's life and that's As why his PA, you need to be aware of his sense of style Don because you'll oh. often be running around picking up stuff for him I've seen this episode I watched this episode Have when you? it went live years and years and years ago. This is one of the most weirdest episodes that we're going to see. This one is very strange and I cannot wait to see your reaction okay. to certain parts. I'm just going to sit like this. This is, yeah, that's thrilling. Oh my God, <laughs> David, is that David you Blaine? You talk too much. Yeah, you yeah, talk too much. much. Yeah. And subscribe I just it. want to listen. Yeah, is there any way we can watch the episodes without you talking? Yeah. No. <gasps> Today, we brought in a celebrity stylist all the way from New York <gasps> to give you... Lady Gaga! <laughs> So if you'd like to make your way into she, the garden. Why has she got her handbag on her still? Yeah. She's like, I'm actually just about to get on the bus, so yeah. I need to go right yeah. now. Number 15. Hello. Hello. <laughs> ding, ding, ding. 
and go and find Patty. Oh, oh, dead. I'm just going to hang it up really, in the garden. I really, really <laughs> love fashion styling, so it was really exciting that we were going to meet yeah, a top yeah. stylist all the way from LA. Hi, everyone. She didn't say LA, she said New York. That's why the lady, we made a Lady Gaga joke, because Lady Gaga's from New York. She was like, I'm really excited to see the stylist from LA. So it was really exciting that we were going to meet a top stylist all the way from LA. No continuity, Gail. Hi, everyone. Hi. I'm Patty. Trujillo, I'm a celebrity stylist. I've worked with Kirsten Dunst, Ed Burns, Jennifer Lopez, and more dominantly, the last three seasons, I was one of the main costume designers for Sex and the City. Oh! So I'm here to discuss celebrity style. Uh, specifically, part of your job as a PA to work with Pete Burns is to make sure that he's able to maintain a image, personal style that it's taken. I cannot imagine that 23 year old knows anything about styling for Pete Burns. I can't yeah. imagine any of them know anything about styling for Pete Burns. I'm surprised that they even like had him on. Yeah, weird, isn't it? That it's clearly for like drama. Yeah. Like, uh. All right, so I've got a rack here of clothes. These are all examples of items that you could pull from. That for Pete, for his wardrobe. As if Pete I'm Burns would ever wear yeah. like And try to get a print. reaction from you as to what you think. A gingham. Um, uh, why don't you tell me what you think about either of these items? Um, I think you've got some very good pattern structure there, but I'm not necessarily thinking that I would take it as it is. I might chop and change it a bit. I think the jacket oh, there has he is. Yeah. Oh, the dress. yellow. No. I do not think that Pete would wear that floral summer Oh, dress. no! I want that coat back within the next two hours. That is not punk. Nothing, like, I'm very shocked about this section. Nothing, no. Now, why don't we talk Ooh. about something right. like this? Oh, picnic and flowers. Yeah, I'm pulling two yeah. things here, not necessarily together. Frock, definitely. What do you think? Frog. With, with the gingham check, I think that could certainly be used as almost cowboy chic, and it could certainly be adapted to a couple of for now. Well, Pete the Burns cowboy chic. Cowboy chic. chic. The sleeves off yeah, the shirt. Maybe the collar off the shirt. Yeah, Daily Mail. Slash the dress somehow. But There's yeah. something about SJ that's just so like, it makes me want, like, it feels like what she's she's trying to impress in a way that's kind of like, she sort of doesn't know how to. So no, she's yeah, really like, yeah. yeah, well, I'd just slash that yeah, off and that, it would yeah. be great. And, yeah. and then I'd read the Daily Mail. <laughs> and it's like, the, the, the gay loves me. The gay, the gay <laughs> loves me because I slashed the neck off that one, yes, yeah, so, and then yeah. the Daily Mail. Yeah. It feels like that. I don't know, what is the word to describe that sort of a person? Yeah. Lacking of personality. I, she, if she watches this, she's going to be like, I hate you. I, I, I read the Daily Mail. <laughs> the Daily Mail does not love me. No. That Move more in keeping, not together. Right, right. Yeah, definitely. But I mean, these are two. Why is she like? Style. She's like doing PE. This next task is about C. Cowboy chic. Yeah, cowboy chic. Can't yeah. wait for Pete Burns' yeah. new cowboy chic Floral outfit. Cowboy chic. Yeah, picnic print and a picnic flower. And a, and a, yes. And a. Wow. What my PA would wear to accompany me to a premiere or a major showbiz event, and what I'm looking for is somebody who can look elegant and stylish. Sometimes a little quirky, but Quir never get quirky. upstage me. Well, that's it, isn't it? You would have to not be someone marvellous and amazing. I would have beaten you. You'd have to not be, like, incredibly amazingly overdressed. No, of course, yeah. Pete would be like, uh, no. Uh, no. 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 Taste. Immediately dead. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Electric chair. Electric chair. You have five minutes to put an outfit together for yourself to wear to a film Oh, premiere, is this for them? Okay. Accompanying Pete Burns. Five minutes is what you've got. Use the knowledge you've gained. Go. Go. Oh. I think it would just be a clever thing to be like, in this sort of situation, I would go for like a statement is the professional star. suit. I'm going mm -hmm. on a professional suit. Oh, look so at that I'm stereotypical tattoo kind of, wear, of the women in the day. Yes. Mel C, this is your fault. She also looks like she's I cosplaying like Wendy's a little bit. In fact, I've actually <laughs> got yeah. too much. I can't decide which way to go with it. I'm thinking LA and I spent a lot of time. Wait, they haven't provided clothes for them. No, That's no weird. budget. No budget. No. They spent it all yeah, on the trash yeah, bin. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, 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 yeah. Literally that. Oh, if you brought any sequins, but the one she's about to go. It's very LA. Mm. This turquoise sequin is very LA. Yeah. Have you been to LA? No, but no. it's very LA. LA, and I know it's hot. And I should be thinking London, but I'm thinking LA. Because I've never been to a film premiere or any sort of premiere, I thought instantly glamour from my perspective that I've always seen in magazines. Normally, I think I would probably go for um, an LBD, but I've not What's had an LBD? A little black dress. Oh. Yeah. Oh, okay, sorry. So, I want- I read the name of the girl, I'm 
something that's quite swishy, yeah. uh, swishy. but quite simple at the same time. So it's not fussy. Electric pink. My thinking was simple. I didn't want to look like. Can you tell us how to say it's vapid or boring? Yeah, but it's just so boring. Well, look at her in a pink dress. Oh, yeah. yeah I've got my jewelry. I've got my spangles. 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 I can't believe I know. Oh, oh lovely. Oh, my God. <laughs> Pop them uh, in and have a laugh. He's like, I'm just going to wear this shirt. All right, everybody, your five minutes are up. Come on down and show me your outfits. I just, I just thought, okay. worried about this task. Every time we see them, the backdrop is like, ta-da! Ta-da! It's like, why? Ta-da! Ta-da! It's like, oh, okay, sure. Uh, because I think I've got a good dress sense. So I think I'm going to do this, really well. This, oh, I want to have a little well, look I down that line, do really well. sis. They're all going to funeral. A dead body. I do actually think, I can't remember any of guy, these the people's guy, names. Yeah. Nice. She's done really well. I also think, is it Ria? Because we just saw mm -hmm. her. I think like a sensible hat. Yeah, stylish. Little black dress, a suit. I said that was acceptable. She looks a bit like an air stewardess, but mm -hmm. I feel like... The, the straight guy is behind that high deck. No, don't, no, don't no, look at me. No, no I've made a no, faux no, pas. No, yeah, oh. is that what you guys said? Faux, faux pas. pas. Yeah. Faux pas where your minge fell out. Yes. Okay, Damon, step forward. The board. music. I like the suit a lot. Love the shirt and tie. Yeah. What about the basis of being a PA is you need to stand next to your celebrity and look like you're the person that other business people need to talk to. Yes, yes, You don't yes. want to look like a friend. You don't want to look like, I'm just related and I'm very confused about the event. You want to look like a professional person that people are going to be like, oh, you're who I hand the business card to. That's what you want. Yeah. Sunglasses. Um, don't wear them. And if you're not going to wear them, don't carry them. Okay. Yeah, you look a bit like a bouncer. I really like the white shirt and the pencil skirt. The only disparaging remark I have is the earrings. I don't think they work with the rest of the outfit. Oh, earrings are personal style, mm -hmm. though. Oh, absolutely Poor not. Thing. <laughs> a waistcoat and a scarf. You have such an earnest expression on your face, but I have to say, you do not look comfortable on what you're wearing. No. And I don't find it believable. <clears throat> Wait, it's come about. Like you're playing dress up. I just don't get the sense of confidence. His look is a bit casino. Yes. If you know what I mean. Like, Hi, not in a bad yeah. way. Oh, yeah. Blackjack girl. Oh, yeah. So anyone? Yeah. yeah. Eight go million. fish. Go. Did they play go fish in casinos? Probably not. No, that's, that's, I feel like that's a very like child game. Yeah, snap. Which you're going to need. I couldn't believe she ripped into my clothes. You couldn't believe no. it. You walked over like this and was like, hello. I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, it was quite personal. And uh, what the hell was she wearing anyway? I think the challenge is for her to be dressing awkward. amazing. I think it's. It's a little much, mm. uh, and not much in the way of glitz. Just it's too. It's a little too formal. It's, it's oh. off the mark. She's dead. Yes. It looks like you're going out to a nightclub, and especially with the shades. I mean, no one can see your eyes. Yeah, don't wear shades. You're trying to get Pete's attention. He won't know where you're looking. Um, it doesn't say professional to me. It says I'm hanging out with the band or I'm going out to the club. It's it's not good. But Pete Burns at this point was in a band. So technically an assistant would be hanging out but with also, the band. I just think like, I think for a challenge like this, they should have like the rack that they just showed them being like, they should have the provided here. them something. Because when, when they're going to go to this stuff, they're actually going to go to premieres and stuff. There'll be occasions that, okay, I need to shop for this. I need to do this. But yeah. because, because they just kind of come onto the show, they should have given them like the rack and been like, I want you to style this. Yes, yeah, style this, show and, us. And they should have gone done the set. They should have had the same pieces yes. and a mannequin and been like, style this. Yes. Style yeah. this, so that everyone can actually be able to see their style rather than being like, you're going to a premiere, put on the dress. Yes, Cause exactly, like, yeah. All of the men are gonna look the same because they're just gonna wear a, a yeah, suit. Yeah. Like me traditional men's formal wear is always a suit. Whereas for women, it can be loads of different variety of things. I can't get over the aubergine. Aubergines. She yeah, pegs him, I'm sorry. <laughs> revealing. I'm crying and shaking. And something a little higher that's not um, <clears throat> quite as tardy. I thought she was bad. You know, yes. I, was on top. Um, I only had a low cut dress on, you know, that doesn't mean that I'm the top. Actually, I think this is a. This, the, I think there's actually, I think that stylist was wrong to say tart mm -hmm. because clearly this girl, she's done glamour modeling and stuff. She has a bigger chest. So I feel like almost anything in which would show any amount of chest here, that stylist oh, would have been yeah. like, you tart, yeah. look at you, you come in tart, yeah. you're a tart, tart. Here she is. I fear that people would think that Pete's brought his aunt rather than his... What is that? Transvestite of the bride? <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to my aunt. I fear that people would think that Pete's brought his I aunt fear. rather than his assistant. <laughs> 
I'm sorry to be cruel, but that's just mm -hmm. just, just the, the look I'm getting. It Can is you a lose bit the coat And let's see what's underneath. <laughs> we went from seeing nothing but a fur to seeing nothing but your. Are you going to call her a tart? Yeah. Oh! I mean, I know. I was quite hurt um, because I feel comfortable in that dress and it suits my frame. She does have a very vintage kind of style, if you know what yes, I mean. Like, yes, there is yes. definitely a vintage edge there. But it's, again, I don't feel, I feel like it's a little bit vintage in the way that doesn't lend itself to thinking glam and film premiere. It's like vintage as in like, nannies going to the salon. Yeah, and like- uh, She's getting heard, her purple yeah, rinse. I saw Clarence the other day. At the clearance yeah, aisle in Clare's, yeah, and the, he died. Yeah, and the rack fell on him. Yeah, death. Yeah, and he was killed by lots of piercing guns. <laughs> oh, here she is. It's very I LA. Think jacket's too much, yeah. I think. It's Why does she keep standing me, really weird? Noisy. She's like, really me. Funga patch, t-shirt's okay, and I really- To be honest with you, I totally agree with that. Okay, and yeah, then, sure what the whole can you let Patsy finish? Yeah, um, it doesn't really say professional to me. Actually, if I really was doing this, I'd probably have a big bag on me, I wouldn't have a jacket on at all. It doesn't really do you any good to come here and say, I coulda, woulda, shoulda. Yeah. I mean, you wear what- But also, this is the thing though, it just shows that they should have supplied them with stuff. Yeah, but again, this goes back to this point. There's something about SJ that, almost, I don't know if maybe she's got, maybe she's got like crippling anxiety or something that's making her almost act uncanny valley. Yeah. It's like she's not actually, like in a way being a genuine human being she's like yeah i totally agree i totally you're completely you're right, yeah, 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 yeah. i completely but agree I everything about my life yes. is entirely wrong yeah, because you've said it oh daily mail <laughs> i read the daily mail i don't know maybe i was a bit quick to judge earlier by being like oh she seems like but actually maybe there's actually something going on with sj that we don't really know which is why she's like it, it took me back to being bullied when i had to jump in a bin and get a lipstick like there was that moment where she was like crying almost mm. because of it i was a bit like oh something's like, you're not ready to go on TV. No! She, uh, she should have failed a psych evaluate. No! <laughs> a beautiful <laughs> butterfly! I screamed, I apologize. To who? I oh, I'm very upset. Oh, I like yeah. silence mm, okay. in my videos. Okay. This is a silent film now. I mean, you wear what you think is appropriate. That dress looks like a slip. It doesn't look like a dress. It doesn't have enough structure. Um, and I don't think it's becoming to see your breasts just kind of call her a top then hanging there in between the two the bodice. This is very I'm going late night to a restaurant instead of I'm actually with my professional yeah. like client here at a like film premiere mm -hmm. because she I, this is one of those things where it's like you need to know where you're dressing for the occasion that you're going to go. But to. these people don't really know that they don't know thing. that. Yeah. And also I wonder if maybe. I've got a bit of a skewed idea of it because I, I'm i not in this like fancy film premiere world at all, but I also am older now that I've, loads of social media has taught me right and wrongs. Yes, like yes, right and yes. wrongs of how to present yourself in a certain environment to, to make other people think of a certain thing. If you if you purposefully want to go to a film premiere and it's a public statement for you to be like, my titties, then that's also fine, but that's I, maybe not what the point is. The, the, the difficult thing about this as well is the fact that we're watching this with today's eyes. Yeah, like, this, is, this is what I you always know, if try we was, If we were this age watching this show back in 2005, six when it was made, like style would have been so different mm -hmm. back then. Girls who would wear stuff like this, you would, they, I think a lot of the time in the media were seen as like sluts. Yes. Now Which meant it's really harsh with the belts. So yeah. Everyone was like, how dare you? So like, I, I think sometimes as well, hearing their comments is a bit like, well, that's a comment that was made back then. Yeah. And now things might have been seen a bit differently. So yeah. it's, it's difficult as well to... Weirdly enough, I can't believe I brought up Jodie Marsh because I remember a very specific thing that Jodie actually set like a trend for. So she wore a bit of contour on her cheek here. I think it was one of those like tat magazines, like mm. tabloid, like newspaper nonsense, you know, the gossip magazines. Mm. And they were like, oh, when doing your makeup, remember not to do a stripe like Jodie. She had a contoured cheek applied by a professional makeup artist. <laughs> so that makes me go, but this was in like 2003 or something. And I was like, wow, they've said, don't put stripes on your face, but it's actually like, that's a contour. Mm. Like that was a professional tip used on someone, but someone without any idea of like future trends of yeah. contouring, which are literally putting stripes on your face and blending them was like, oh, uh, don't no, do this, no. otherwise you look like a whore, like yeah. Jodie. We've got to remember, very much of the time. Totally remember there, yes, very there, yes, clap. Oh, oh Jodie's in Yeah, yeah. Jodie, yeah. we do miss her. Yeah. Dead now. <laughs> Jodie Marsh is not Casual. dead. No, there is Jodie Harsh. Too... I don't know, it looks like you're wearing a slip. You know, it's not nice to hear, but good advice. It's a slipper you know, nighty, is that what that is? I have no idea. I have no idea. If I was lucky enough to go. 
as a celebrity PA, that's not the kind of look you're going for. You're going. She's got a penis necklace. Yeah. With managers, publicists, agents. You're you're checking for cars. You're checking where the press are, and you're just kind of keeping your client covered. And frankly, I don't think any of them would have done the job in any of those outfits. There was a winner and oh. a loser. Oh. Oh. Rhea, they had to lip sync. You were the loser. Dead. <laughs> it's clear that you weren't thinking in professional terms when you picked out your outfit and got dressed. You were thinking more in social terms. I don't think Rhea liked it for one moment that she lost. Damon, you're the winner. Yeah. Oh, oh Damon. Damon. Damon, Gail. Damon. You really stood out as someone who made an effort to appear professional. It's but not wearing an oversized suit. Yeah, it was really oversized, wasn't it? And uh, that's a bit of a styling She should have worn what she's wearing here. That mm. would have been fine. Yeah. Damon, as a winner... She's quite sweet. ...you get to choose the members of your team for tomorrow's challenge. Oh. So please choose four people and have them stand behind you. We've got a first team challenge. Yeah. 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 Actually, technically, the bin diving was yeah. the first challenge. SJ, Shelley, and Denise. I believe Damon picked Denise and SJ because they're strong contenders. She's always like, she's modeling. Yeah, she's, she's always like, 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 she's, like she's using this as like a I'm the celebrity. Pick up me, pick yeah, up me, pick up magazine. The remaining people will be the members Killed. of your team. Each team Guillotine. will be working. Lloyd's Bank has texed me. Oh, your only friend. Photo <laughs> shoot, <laughs> because obviously being a model myself and being in photo shoots all the time, you know, I thought it would be a She's really got a degree. Yeah. And here so basically we missed a little section there. They're saying that the winners, no, they're saying that the teams get to style Pete Burns on a photo shoot for the next day. Yeah. Which is actually quite exciting. That's, yeah. I'm, I am I think I would do that quite Cowboy well. Cowboy chic. Cowboy chic, can't wait. Talk Picnic who? The shoot is a nice Andrew clog. Edward Lister, the fashion director. I don't know who that is. <laughs> Hello. Hello! I'm gay! Yeah. <laughs> um, for those of you who don't know, AXM is a gay men's monthly magazine. Now, tomorrow's photo shoot is... Oh, AJ's at... Yes, guys! Yes, yes. yes. They love They're, me! The gays love me! ...of a magazine, and therefore, the styling has to be completely up to scratch. What are this man doing? Yeah, what... Well, if you are... What was his name? Andrew Lady Garden. Andrew Edward Lister. Yeah. Would what you is, please reach out if you're you watching? Now, yeah. You're on TV, girl. Would you please reach out and say what? The winning shoot will appear in the September issue of the magazine. Ooh, September. And therefore, the styling has to be completed up to scratch. We were then given our theme for the photo shoot. Oh. <laughs> dead. <laughs> dead. <laughs> A dead body. Dead. Huh? Dead. 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 <laughs> <laughs> a dead body. Dead. Dead. <laughs> it's literally like we've made this. It's like, what is the theme? <gasps> dead. <laughs> but you know, actually, because he's part of Dead or Alive, I reckon the other card's gonna say Alive. Yeah, that's true. Oh. Alive. Oh, there we go. Alive? But like dead, you think of like things, but alive, what would you what's that what does that even mean? Like, vivaciously vibrant. I would always go with like flowers. Oh. Not Pixelations. <laughs> Spend the rest of this afternoon planning your shoot and this evening. Look at her, see, she's standing again like she's like modelling. I think it's a very dangerous challenge for them because I've never used a stylist on a photo shoot before. Exactly. So this is yeah. first for me as well. Um, if they leave me looking like a, a crock of shit or an explosion in a jumble sale, I ain't going to be happy. I mean, that's what's going to happen. Yeah, that is what happens. Oh, that. Coming up, me. Does he love these flowers or something? What's with, I, what's I, with I the see, flowers? We see them all the time. I don't know what the point is. I've, I, what even is that flower? Is it a lotus? Uh, a lotus. A lesbian lotus, lotus yes. filled with love and lead. Knowing that tomorrow they've got to style Pete for a photo shoot. I'm going to get clocked for this music. Nah, nah. In the garden, oh, in the garden, kids. Which is alive. Alive! This whole idea a livelihood! She's not naked. Only, you know, not just the alive idea, but it's about the rebirth of his... That's right. You know, the career, and it's, it's a sort of metaphor for him, actually. Yeah. So what's dead, then? A metaphor, a metaphor for him, also, yeah. 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 Their theme, which is dead. Dead. Of Christ. Well, yeah, I was that. thinking that. I, I love, I love that. that. Him, like, basically, in the crucifixion mm -hmm. scene. Mm -hmm. I had the theme of doing dead, crossed out, not. Mm -hmm. Because, yeah. that, mm -hmm. because he's not dead. But dead, he's crossed not. out, not. What part of Pete do you nah. see Christian? Yeah. What I mean, part of Pete do you think of religious, like, Christian? He has done religious photo shoots before, but, like, all of the icons kind of did, like, um, I know, kind of, like, a bit naughty to talk about now, but Marilyn Manson did lots of things about being like the Antichrist, but why they would put them as Christ is a little bit like, I don't know, it's a bit much, but also SJ's like, dead, 
not dead. Um, no, I yeah. don't feel like any of these ideas are going to work no. just yet. That it's because she reads the Daily Mail. The Daily Mail, the Daily Mail, the Daily Mail. Kind of resurrecting, which is why I like the idea of the cross. Mm. Yeah, it's totally, yeah. The, 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 the resurrection is about life. Life, yeah. Quite, 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 quite the resurrection of the career. Yeah, yeah. It's about Absolutely. the spiritualism, the yeah. metaphor for alive. Um, yes. it's, yeah. it's the. Why, Can we just why? film you in the garden talking yeah. about the theme? Yeah, and yeah. my little swing chair. Live swing with me. It's the swing, swing, swing. wing. It's the swing, swing wing. I've got a bucket of piss, sweetie. Rising of his career, the rising of the sun. Why are they both going for spiritual stuff? Punk Go away. Not. What? She's really I pushing. Do the punk dead not. She's really. I want to do the punk dead not. I want to do the punk dead not. As in, like, punk's not dead. I think oh. we need to represent that, you know, have movement. She's really pushing that idea of being like. Mm. Um, so the fountain sort of youth. Yeah. To represent oh, life. Oh, we could that do thing. one sun sort of light thing and one sort of youth fountain of. You I mean, we've got, got, got two shots, haven't we? Oh, she really didn't have much to add to that conversation, did she? Did I'm here yeah. to me. I don't want to go home. No. Other gays hate don't me. Know. Don't know. Dead, um. dead unt. The colour is dead, dead, dead unt. For me, for, you know, for being alive. The bloody thing. Oh, dead I'm so glad you shared that yeah, with the group, yeah. Ian. What was that? Uh, the colours of being alive? Important for me for, you know, for being alive. Wait, it's important wait. for me for being... I need to hear that again because it was so like. W the colour is important for me for, you know, for being alive. <sighs> just, just. What is the point? Just, just go leave. home. Just, just go, go home. Go the home. Colour is important to me for being alive. <laughs> Bloody thing. Dead or something. Mm. Dead. Dead. Or not dead. dead. <laughs> Whatever, yeah. Or resurrection. Yeah, and yeah. white. Obviously, what about resurrection? Because that's got all that... Dead and white. Idea, you, know, uh, uh, you can get the word mm. play on that one, can't you? There's, not, there's lots of things you can do. But you get the word play on resurrection. Mm. Uh, I think, to be honest, the Jesus Christ might be just uh, maybe a little bit too, but too open. You just don't know. Well, it could be. I like the word uh, resurrection. I I resurrection. Because she's really fucking shit. Resurrection. 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 Oh, no, 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 no. Not dead. Yeah, resurrection. No, 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 not resurrection. dead. If you're doing not dead, that's not the theme, sis. Go back to the Daily Mail. <laughs> it's got that kind of slight resurrection thing. Oh, for God's sake, shut up. Oh, why don't you have a resurrection if you're so happy with it? <laughs> why don't you marry the resurrection? Stigmata. That actually the other team were going to be banned from using it. You say what did she it. say? And the implications from that meant that actually the other team were going to be banned from using it. You say no to the internet, we can't use it. That That's basically oh, the Oh, drama. To be fair, hands on heart, when I came out, I said we don't need the internet. But can you not just say yes? The so internet? You can use it even if you just, just look through it. For you to say no, you are, you, you're basically saying you're just going to jeopardise our chance really, aren't you? Uh, we'll discuss it again. We were just saying no because we don't actually need to use it. Okay, well, bear in mind. Sorry, what is happening? Mean, we we watch this section. So the internet. about using the internet. They just want to use the up. internet. Oh. Don't touch me! What? Right, let, let everybody be quiet in the studio. Yeah, shut up! Our team decided we weren't going to use the internet, and the implications from that meant that actually the other team were going to be banned from using it. You say no to the internet, we can't use it. That, that's basically the name of the game. To be fair, hands on heart, when I came out, I said we don't need the internet. But can you not just say yes, so we can use it even if you just, just look through it? I don't understand. I'm really confused. Yeah, well, you're yeah. not allowed to use the internet. Is it? Are they trying to come up with like stylistic ideas about like dead and alive? To, trying, I guess that. But the thing is, I guess if you give them the internet, they have the you have the chance of them like almost like copying. I guess because are they monitoring everything they're seeing? Yeah. I think for a challenge like this, like. Come up with it in your, if you're going to books, be, give them supplies, yeah. give them like, oh, this is something that's been done before. Do it. Because the point of this surely is to create a good outcome. But here it just seems to be like, can you do a drama challenge? Yeah, it's weird. I don't have understand. a fight. I'm Someone gone. Yeah, there. she's a bitch. <gasps> Say no, you are. You're basically saying you're just going to jeopardize our chance. Yeah, you're not allowed to use the Internet, so you have to uh, immediately die. The thing as well is like if they're not going to use it, the other people can't use it as well. Then it's like, it's like an even fair playing for yeah. it's better that none of them use it than one does and one doesn't because I don't understand I personally think like if you're going to use the internet it's like I feel like you're going to end up cheating 
I honestly don't I'm understand really confused, what is what, yeah, what, what, what the point what? of being like, no, no internet, but also die, death. But we would just say no, because we don't actually need to use She's it. She's dead. Okay, well, bear in mind, if you don't want it, we can't use it. All right, all right. But it's an even yeah. playing field then, isn't it, really? Like, yeah, that's the point. We've decided that we should both be allowed to the internet. We are both allowed to the internet. Yeah. And they can can you tell us about the internet whilst oh, you're yeah. salting this salad? Is it about re resurrection salad? Yeah, resurrection. Uh, not dead, not no, salad. No, yeah. Not use the internet. Yeah. That's, 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 that's the fair way, because the other day, they'd already agree. How much? How, how much pepper? pepper? You're gonna give people a heart attack. What, what are you doing? Oh, no, oh, no, 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 no. The Daily Mail. The Daily Mail <laughs> loves me. <laughs> 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 no, no one's gonna eat that no, salad, no. SJ. They, you know, they, they know they know dinner's here, so it's their own choice. If they don't want to come, then you know it's already. What's with the that but, like? We don't eat dinner. Together. Halo menu music. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, we're here. Well, do you know what? I actually don't want to oh, live. Noodles. And this is competition, and we're not going to make friends. And it's horrible. It's She's got a lovely, nice, like, muscular pose. Yeah. Yes. I mean, that's true, though. They're here to win a competition. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly it. I'm not here to make friends. I'm here to get down. Do they know dinner's here. Why don't they want to play Happy Families? Is it because she's too busy reading the Daily Mail? Yes, it's she's dead. The shoot, and the teams have only got two hours and two, two hours. hours to get what they need to style P. To style P. Like to stop so pinning things on. Yeah. Make, cool. Arranging you the train. You can be the eyes. Yeah. I'll be, I'll, yeah. yeah. Stuff. You can do the eyes. Maybe even body stuff. You can do the boobs. You know, things like that, maybe. Is it me Something. or does SJ talk a load of rubbish? Yes. She's got the pageant. We do not endorse the Daily Mail. We do not. No, thank you. You can obviously pick anything up. Okay, guys, what do you think? Um, so, uh, get reaction. What a horrible, yeah. horrible little girl. Uh, <laughs> yeah, what do you think about this? Are they in like a charity shop? Maybe. Effect. I'm wondering if we can test no out the uh, flowing thing. We've got different layers here we can use. Layers? For fabrics and stuff. Lemons. That's horrible. He's not going to want to wear that. What is this for? Just... Is this for dead or alive? Who are these people? What's happening? <laughs> <laughs> there's like no, I, there's no impact on this show that no. I'm like, I know who's talking about what. Yeah, well, they, they go to the prom, so. Oh, lovely. Yeah. I could not believe it. Some fabric. You know, we've got some fabric with us. No, we got some maybe fabric. we need to concentrate more on getting some fresh new. I think shoes. Yeah. Shoes. Shoes. Yeah, we you know, really a bit left out. We felt that Rhea and Nikki sort of took over a bit. Oh. Um, and. Oh, it's a bit disappointing, really. I feel like Debbie would be a lovely person to have as just like, you know, in your, like when you're related to like the lovely aunt, you're just yeah. like, I love seeing Auntie Debbie. I cannot imagine that she would be very visceral in the cutthroat world of like being a PA. Yeah, in, in, in this scenario, like as much as I appreciate that it must be difficult, if you don't speak up, you cannot complain. Yeah, like, this is, not this the, is a this competitive is, yeah, this scenario. Is not, this is not the scenario that you'd be like, I just wanted to have my turn. No one no. wants to give you a turn. It's yeah, like, I'm this going is to a win. Competition. Yeah, this yeah. is a competition. Camden Lock girls! Yeah, maybe marathon's a bad example because it's not really a race, it's more of like a completion. A sprint, yeah. yeah. Like the 400 meter sprint. Yes, 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 yes. Yes! I definitely think that we need to really get to Shopping the in the yeah. underground, yeah. Yeah. we're yeah. in the club. Yeah. Resurrection. Really kind of wasting yeah. time. Okay, what, anything in here? No, no. Haven't seen him yet. Sure. Yeah, absolutely. Yes, yeah, yeah. Please, yeah. Thank you. No, nothing here says no, Daily nothing, nothing, nothing here says Daily Mail. No, Donna Resurrection. They're modelling an outfit on Ian. Mm. That's the other thing, if it's going to scratch Pete. But this isn't... No, 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 it's going to scratch no, no. Pete. You're going to... We can't really do that. Really it's going to scratch him. Yeah, we can't. Get him out. <laughs> Why are they getting the, like, buff man to model Pete's outfits? Like, Pete is what? A size 8 to 10 or something? I don't know what his size is. This seems a bit like... Oh, because he's a man, he can wear the outfits that Pete's yeah. gonna wear. Pete doesn't really wear like masculine fits. Yeah. So it doesn't really work, but sure. You know what? 2000 what? Seven? Go for it, sis. Oh! No, I don't I think the fabric Ooh, looks CD. Cheap as well. Cheap, but... Any yeah. excuse yeah. to cross dress! It's quite comfortable, actually. Yeah. <laughs> as soon as I put it on, I was just like, oh my god, I'm standing here in a dress in the middle of a shop. And you loved it. Gotham Punk Market! Oh, this shop doesn't exist anymore. This was one of my favourite really? shops in Camden, yeah. Ooh. They have a wall of demonia, or they used to have a wall of demonia 
shoes, but it burnt down. Oh dear. They you burnt it. They're just, they're just too childlike. They, yeah, I, I really do. And they're, they're like, I've, I've, I'm 15, I've come out, I've got my pocket money, I've come to buy skulls. You know, yeah. I'm, I see what you're saying. I'm, 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 I'm yeah, he wears stop. Vivian Westwood. Mm. Like, he always wore designer clothes. Right, so. Not. It's a shame, though, we couldn't go somewhere Smithies. like... Um, well, we can't, we can't. So, let's move on. <laughs> we can't be quiet! We can't, so shut up! <laughs> All I'm hearing from her is, oh, if only we could do this, you know. Oh, if only... But there are no open phonies. They have £200, they've got another 25 minutes or... Pete would never wear a £200 outfit. Ever. Ever. You could imagine saying to Pete Burns, we you... bought the, we've got this entire, like, not even just like a top, like an entire outfit for 200 pounds. And this is what I mean, I don't understand how like, they're not representing what Pete would actually be doing. It's because there's no budget. It's there's weird. no budget. It's so weird. Well, this is the thing. It's not even kind of like, we're saying this, that, that's a really cheap outfit. I just spent fucking 200 pounds on clothes and shit. Like, it's not about that. It, but it's like the person that they're trying to style is so different to what they're being yeah, given. Yeah. It's like, I don't understand. <clears throat> so I've read Pete Burns's autobiography. I don't feel like anyone in here would have, although I guess it probably came out around the same time that this kind of came out. But for example, he used to go and with his like ex-wife at the time, go and buy like big bulky jumpers and rip them open to create his own punk mm -hmm. wear. He did never, it wasn't like, I'm gonna go to the punk shop and, just and buy, buy a punk yeah. outfit because yeah. I'm punk. Cause that's not what the essence of punk is. So. So take that, guillotine! But then they have to make some decisions. Okay, yeah. guys. There's the wall of demonium. Mm. Oh, I missed it. What if we're wasting money though? I'm just concerned with the moment. How much, how much, how much is, is it? 30 pounds. Oh, it's a lot. We're in the second shop. We've got one more shop to go to. So what, why don't we try that? Are we not allowed to come back to the shop? Yeah, why don't we just try the next shop? No, we can come back. We can. Oh, we're not. We're not buying it. We can, so SJ, stop doing all that. Yeah, we're going to be fine. We're going to Resurrection. Okay. No. Well, no resurrection. We could shop here all day, but we're Stop on the time. Right now. Now. Okay. I'm not dead. These two pieces. Mm -hmm. uh, this is great. It's eight pounds. We've got this one for, and this one's ten. What I'm wondering is, knowing the fact that it's for a photo shoot, it's for a, a good celebrity. It's going to be all over the world. Mm -hmm. Perhaps do as a deal. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. A, a good, good celebrity. Cash, very limited. Just four people. We've got much money. Would you do as it? We Actually, that's a really. They, they've raised a really good point. Nowadays, if a really famous pop star was going to wear an outfit and need to be styled for a shoot, no one on their team would pay for that outfit. No, that would no, be no, like no, no, either no. donated, yeah. borrowed, or it would be like part of the campaign in itself, like paid for. Like what is the photo shoot for? I guess it's for the show in this yeah, sense, yeah, yeah. but if they were in the real world, the, the photo would be for a reason. It would be to either model somebody else's designer clothes yes. or for like the photo shoot for an album cover. Everything would be covered in the sort of like business aspect That's of it. That's the thing, the richer you- The PA would be not involved in this at no, all. No, no. And the richer you become as well, the more things you get for free. Isn't that ironic? So the true capitalism is no true socialism is get really rich in capitalism. So all these like people, all these like celebrities things that do this, they don't pay for any of their outfits. It's do you all think they're gonna be like yeah, them. all gifted? They're not gonna be like, can you do a deal? Ten pounds. No, for this and the thing as well, she's like, it's gonna be all over the world. You're just doing a little photo shoot for a TV show. This yeah. is not an actual also, photo shoot. The very fact that you then said it's gonna be all over the world, everyone's gonna see it. They're gonna be like, oh, pay me more then. Yeah. Do is it both for a tenner? Oh, okay. Right. Well, Thank they bullied her into giving mm -hmm. her them. Yeah. Bye -bye. Cameras. She was bye -bye. with the person on the back. Cameras, yeah. yeah. This is the other one. Ooh. 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 Not, 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 not. Not for her, we're not going for the car. Either. No, we're not. We're going to. Oh, that in the back. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Much right. better. Nothing about That's people and says these shoes. Oh, a cork wedge. Um, Stop trying to barge why, why, why would they. What? Pete Burns would never wear a cork wedge. No. Beachwear, never! Electric chair. And these, I like the style of these. Uh, yeah, everything I said was was just not being listened to. And, it's because uh, you're kind of picking things that you would wear again. though, yeah. don't you? Uh, I just felt very well, fed up, really, I suppose. Is there any possibility of um, loaning us the shoe? I have the shoe. Okay. Yeah, I'm sure that because be if okay. we stood on fabric. I'm sure that should be okay. Never! No. Um, I think that would be great for our. Uh... <sighs> Yeah. It would be if we just yeah. managed to get to any other shops. Exactly. Should we? Don't know how much time we've got. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Why, why do they want to borrow a pot? Oh, thank you. I think Nikki is definitely taking control. She is loving this challenge. This is I really like want this pot. Oh, run! The punk market is going to close. <laughs> It's just nail varnish we're really needing. No, I don't think so. Why not? Let's look what they've got. Let's just keep looking. Oh, oh like oh, grey and pink things she's wearing. It's a vintage item. It's a vintage item. 
And no, forget. Forget no one, Forget. Forget. Well, SJ doesn't, you know, listen to a word that we say. No, she doesn't. Because she reads the daily It's all about her. And the daily mail. There's a bit of kind of tension here, so you're not that happy. Time's running out, time's running out. I feel like my ideas are shouted down constantly. By who? Um, SJ. By, I don't know, SJ, for example. Oh, yeah. Everything I say, no, everything I say, you'll just say, no, 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 no. But, Natalie, no, so we had this discussion yesterday. That was the whole point of yesterday. Not no, today. we didn't have the discussion. You had the discussion. Yeah, you had the discussion, and everybody else was like, Because oh, you were like, resurrection, I don't want to hear about the Daily Mail. Resurrection, resurrection, resurrection. Resurrection. No. Stop it. Get some help. Yeah, we were being really, really sure we were going to do hair and makeup. We were almost deaf. Not, okay, not, not makeup. I'm makeup. absolutely. I said the nails are great. I'm focused on nails. But it's good to have backup, like you said. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's why we're doing that. And yeah, that's okay, what we're let's doing. go then. Okay, still don't look entirely happy. <laughs> no, I'm fine. Let's How go. How funny. My patient's really starting to fray, and um, and I've been. I think I've been really, really patient. What happened to Stan is that Natalie drifts a lot, and she's got great ideas. But we spent all of last night sanding things out, and we had a really clear shopping list. We've brought it out with us. We absolutely decided that we would not veer away from the shopping list. And we would read the Daily yeah, Mail. Yeah, the guys love me. I don't know. It'll do. It'll is this work. a fabric shopping oh, here? Hello. Can you help us? We're up. I've been to this fabric. Job. Yeah. Some kind of uh, lightweight material that will flow with a fan. So like a. I think pack. this is the fabric shop that I bumped into Stephen Fry in. Oh really? Actually. I think and this has the sex. One. No. Oh, and of course, it's got to be pure, uh, like a white. pure white. Yeah. Yeah. Great. Can we come in? Thank you. That was a long way of just saying. Just saying, can I have some white fabric, please? Yeah. Getting on everyone's nerves. So Damon decided to be the big man and take her aside and have a word with her. Fish and face task. Yeah. yeah. Can we just. Can you just be, just take a chill pill, almost? Absolutely, yeah. yeah. I mean, I mean, there are a few people in the team. She's so like, immediately like, yeah, 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 yeah. Anything you want, babe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. And then just yeah. like, I don't know, <laughs> very straight. Yeah, the Daily Mail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. The Daily Mail. Anything look, the Daily Mail wants. Look at the trolley. Trolley. And look, they're just around somebody's yeah. bins having and this conversation. With some like a bent table. What's this? A weird pig of slag, like slag of, a slag of. A weird pig of slut. <laughs> a weird slab of wood, just like bent over the table, getting raw dogged by trolleys. Oh, very Salvador Dali. Yes. She's got a degree. Quite upset, almost quite irritated oh, by, by, by the SJ that we love. Okay, no, it's um, Obviously, we need, we need to... By the SJ we love, we don't love SJ. Mm. We need to hear everybody's inputs as well, mm -hmm. um, you know, and at the moment, I think they're feeling as though it's a bit... Bah, 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 bah. That's fair enough. You know, and they, I can't have that. And she didn't... I can't have it! I can't have that. it! I don't want to read the Daily Mail! You seem like a bit overpowering where you're saying... Well, you, are, you are a very strong character. Well, yeah, well, which is good. You are, you are, you are a very strong character. Oh, she's immediately going to be like, it's no, me! No, it's not, no, no, bullying me! Yes! It's a laughed off and it's like, no, no your opinion never laughed right off. I'm just thinking, God, I'm really excited, I'm focused on this. No, I know that, I know that. You are, though, you know. In the car, Estre wound me up so much because she just wouldn't listen to anyone. She was all about her. Mm -hmm. What about me? It doesn't surprise me as well from yeah. the very beginning. I, I just... Everything was no, 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 no. Well, I get pissed off because I've got probably... To a limited is quaking. Today, and I just feel like I'm not, I haven't said any of it. Well, you know, we all get our moments, don't we? No, and, I'm, and I'll show them as well. So. I don't. My God, so... It would I mean, feel horrible to have everyone gang up on you like this, though. Bad. All we want is just a extra few words, though. Just, that, just, that just to make but sure that you're not, you're not overshadowed almost. I'm, I'm yeah. not even trying, you know, I'm no, not, I know. Even, not You're not overshadowed almost. I'm, I'm yeah. not even trying, you know, I'm no, not I know even... You're not no, I know you're not no, trying I know. to do I'm it. Like, that's you. Right. We couldn't even finish a single sentence. And it's a pity that you've had to speak to me like that because actually I bring a lot to these kind of things. I know. I'm oh, the victim. It's actually uh, it's I read it's because yeah. I read the Daily Mail, yeah. isn't it? It's the gays because the yeah. gays love me. Yeah, no, hey, yes, I'm gay. It's a complete. But I'm not actually gay. Breakdown. Not breakdown. That sounds far too dramatic. But I had a complete breakdown, but not actually. No. I just wanted to get the hell out of here. I just wanted to get my Daily Mail and get. I wanted to get my own way in the Daily Mail. I feel sorry for us. Coming up. Coming the up. Daily Mail. <laughs> <laughs> Rear's team have arrived at the studio for the magazine Dead photo time. shoot and they head straight to the Got dressing degree room to of the year. Oh look! She's got crew. a degree. Oh, she's got oh a dead. But the paradise. Oh, they stole it. We really wanted this bar. His team include his fiance Michael Simpson. Ooh. Oh, he looks so good in this stylist, shot. Michael Patrick Simpson. Trujillo, a magazine a fashion though. editor Andrew Edward Lister. And celebrated fashion photographer Ooh. Frederick Aranda, who worked with Donatella Versace, Duncan. Donna Kebab. 
Oh, we're not allowed to hear that. No, no. Rejected. Okay, so tell me what you got abroad. Okay, so the first concept was thinking about alive being the fountain of you. He looks so good. Mm -hmm. That everyone Look at that pussy nose. Look at that Only butterfly. The fountain of you is left rotting at the side, whereas you will be reborn. Maybe um, you're a plastic surgeon. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> because believe me, it's all done with scalpels and syringes. <laughs> oh. Beautiful fabric. Yeah. Nikki uh, wouldn't stop talking, so I decided to take a step back. Uh, so it'd be better for the team. Yeah, I decided to take a step back means I didn't feel I, like no, saying I was I nervous. Just say I got no, frightened. No, I, People talking, it just wasn't going to win us the task. The second idea was thinking about the rebirth of life. So we were going to bring in um, lighting. Um, You've really tried here, haven't you? Yeah. yeah. We've brought in. Um, yeah. We could, what we would like to do was reflect. The, we thought you had a beautiful kind of alabaster purity to you with the redness of your lips against the heart. And our idea was that you were holding your life in your hand and that you wore your heart on the sleeve because of the, the job that you do. We've got absolutely... Yeah, I mean, that's quite, it's quite good, you know, that could go any which way, couldn't it? Oh, what did I say in the back this morning? If the Clavadilla got me fabric. It seems to be all about Rhea and Nikki and... Um, I didn't feel that Ian and I were allowed to get involved at all, mm. and we got very put to the bottom, actually. That's because the gays so don't have two ideas. I'm going to go with the loose fabric, and I think he did really, really well. Uh, I think really, 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 really well. Just going through the draping and the Grecian themes, I think it would suit and fit in perfectly with not just the magazine, but Pete himself. I think the drapery and Grecian themes would go great with the gay men's mm. magazine. Yeah. Your dogs are gay. It's like a toga. Okay, okay. just yeah. do it. Go for it. A tiger? A toga? Mmm. Yeah. Just do it. Go for it. Oh, just do it. Gail. Gail. They're going to go on the shoulder. Toga. I'm so pleased with what you came up with. I mean, I really that's have, I know this is actually all right. Like I feel like this team's happen. gonna win. Mm. Although we don't know yet because no. we haven't seen the Daily Mail. No whatsoever. We were told to look after the set, which is fine. <laughs> <but> <laughs> like, will you give it a <laughs> f <laughs> Stop promoting the Daily Mail, the hate magazine. Maria and Nikki, of course, were in there with Pete. We were just left to our own devices. I was left to put gaffer tape on this bucket. <laughs> With Pete on set, Damon's team arrived to keep their eye on the competition. I bet they do. There's no full-length mirror around that you can wheel out here, is there? Excuse me, is there a full-length mirror you can wheel out here so no one's in the garment? All I could hear was Pete shouting for a mirror, so I went and got one off the That's wall. That's quite proactive. And, uh, ended up keeping Pete happy. Who's that, so Twink? Really <laughs> Ian, you're gonna have to, like, we go to the oh, so gorgeous. <laughs> I know he's completely he's insane, insane, but also just yeah. gorgeous. Oh, America's next top transvestite! Oh, oh, of the bride! Mm. He's working it. Yeah. Work it's it, girls. Really, really well. She's got gown. At the moment. Oh, and I do love a good photo shoot. Definitely There's still a now. part of me that's that like America's Next Top Model fan from 2004 being like, yay, photo! I hate having my photo taken. Why? I hate it. You literally work with photos. I know, but I hate it. I really think we've stand a good chance with this one. I agree. I think that so far I'm actually like, yeah, sure, go for it, go. But we didn't know what the other people had done. The other group was positively ill. Like, they don't know what they're doing. Well, the stylist knows. Yeah, die. Oh, yeah, no, this, no, this is alive, isn't it? Alive. Making Pete feel so comfortable. It's, it's uh, really nice. God. <laughs> oh. Well done. Well, well done. Must have been very oh, difficult. Hugs from everybody. Have a cuddle. Yeah, monkey pox. Not gone any better. Um, <laughs> it was perfect. When I walked in. And so all the beautiful material flow in, and, and I just died. A crisp and just clean. Oh, what have they done? I'm getting really bad vibes here. Absolutely. This isn't the episode that I thought it was. Oh, is way. it not? No, this isn't. Mortified with our mm. bag. Mortified. Of so you lied. I did. Yeah. Liar. Oh, well, there is an episode oh, I bet coming you read up the Daily Mail. Still. I do. Yeah, I love it. I love the Daily yeah, Mail. The, the gays, gays love me. Absolutely mortified with our mm. bag of lycra green. Yeah. Gear. Yeah. Whatever the reason, it's time for Damon's team to pitch their ideas to Pete. Oh, I want the you to put in a frock. To have you in a rather stunning, flowy red dress, and maybe with the backdrop as well. 
because of the gay gay magazine having because words of the gay because of the gay oh. maybe you can like, almost like react to the words behind mm. something like that. Yeah, yeah, certainly. Yeah. This is the uh, red outfit we, we got for you. It's great because it's got lots of uh, lots of flow, flow material. I must admit, this would not be my choice of fabric in a million years. Oh, She's always oh straight God. in there, isn't she? She's always straight in there and be like, I it's must admit, it's not my it's fault. Not, no, it's not nothing to do with me. I also agree that I should be executed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> She's very topsy turvy, yes man. And that, oh, there's awful. something about her that I'm just like, I could, I couldn't have someone like SJ on my team. Well, also because, because she's she, instantly throwing everyone under the bus. Well, it's, I didn't yeah, get this. No, yeah, no, uh, yeah, exactly. And it's like actually, she probably look at did. Her, look at her face. She's like, I'm like, going to I kill you in your face. I knew it. I knew it. You read the we Daily saw Mail. I had a suspicion. Yes. But we only had three goth shops. SJ again Three wanted to get shops. noticed, so you know, she stood in front of Peach, said this is the outfit we've got, but you can wear it like this, like that. But you know, she kind of just took over and I just think at the end of the day, we're working Insufferable. Thing. Yeah. You know, let everyone have a say. Yeah. Because you think dead straight. <laughs> well, i got to say right now, the backdrop, the idea of the backdrop is, is crap. I'm not okay. going to get involved in all that, right. you know, politics about straight, gay, oh, all that's that fine. crap. That wasn't really... But also, like, why would you be like, I want to put you in this and then wear it yourself? Oh, it's Imagine, very strange, like, put on, isn't it? Like, what, I d Do we look at the next outfit and see? Second choice we, we've gone for is um, a rather iconic image, rather controversial image of you being crucified. Um, we like the idea... Honey, I've already done that. Actually, actually on cross. Yeah, I did it in a big photo shoot in Australia that was very controversial. There you go. Okay. The second dress we've chosen is, uh, seems white, has lots of cutaways, lots, when, lots when, of flow. When does Shirley Bassey want it back? Um, by the six o'clock tonight. Okay. Um, <laughs> we, we, we can incorporate um, with the idea and of... A nice pinstripe suit, I We can incorporate some... Some, some, some blood, maybe, onto, onto the sleeves. If your arms are up being crucified, okay, that's just... I'll try on the red one. In the interest of it being wow. a conversation, I'll try on the red one. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no. No. Okay, thank thank you. You. Oh, executed. Wow. Yeah, that was just awful. So That's what happens when... Too many cooks. Too many cooks, but also when someone tries to dismiss everyone else. Yeah. And, and then at the end was like, well, it wasn't my no, choice. No, 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 it's nothing no, to do with me, no. actually. It's like, the, all we've heard throughout this entire challenge is you being like, no, we can't do that. We've got no, to do a lot of resurrection. No, 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 no don't. No, not no, dead. No, no, the, no, 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 the Daily Mail. 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 Yeah. Hard pitch. A hard, hard pitch, I thought. I'm fucking mortified. <gasps> if I'd have said what I thought, they wouldn't even be standing here. These didn't. twings are like, oh no. <laughs> He's upset. <laughs> for him, to be honest. Mm. I felt yeah. really sorry for him. I feel sorry for him. Oh, we'll be well, limited now. Yeah, we'll be so pissed. I'd have a pig's ear. The white one was like a prostitute from King's Cross. Oh. The red one was a vile shade of red. It was so nylon, and then my fucking hair is nylon. I'm nylon. So the whole situation is going to be fucking static, isn't it? Oh, I, the last time I had this feeling was the first day at boarding school. What really grazed on me was, I think it's SJ, just for the whole time shaking her head and apologising for their choices. Hi, uh, Actually well, quite iconic. I'm getting a bit hyperactive, I had a coffee OD. It's not as bad as I thought. Out on the studio floor, well, who's gonna win and then? the rest of the team wait to see if Pete's going to go ahead with the rest of the shoot. He needed to change his hair black. Yeah. yeah. If he was yeah, wearing blonde hair, it would have been not good. Needs to be. I feel like Pete Burns is very Sorry. high contrast. High contrast, complicated patterns. Nobody laughs. I still prefer the first. Yeah. So far. Although I do. I actually quite like that red. Step in. Oh, it's all wrong. It's all wrong. I didn't choose this, but I did actually. She's a bit insufferable. There's not much really going on. Not like you know that there has to be, but yeah, I think it just doesn't look comfortable in, in at the moment. Oh yeah. That's great. Oh, yeah, yeah. All you can hear is SJ. That's mm. great. Uh, I think their garment's good. But I don't think they're creating an atmosphere, um, and I think therefore ours has more flow to yes, it. Yes, yours definitely. Like, yeah. yeah. I think ours is better, maybe. <laughs> She's insufferable. 
take a step back. I've been the subject of photo shoots myself, so I do like it when someone's... For the so Daily I Mail. do know what I'm doing at the Daily Mail. <laughs> I don't need to tuck in. I appreciate that because sometimes you can't, but he does have that mirror, which is brilliant. Yeah. She's such a complicated character yeah. because I'm like... Is there no part of you going, I'm clearly doing the most, yeah. a team too much, and I need to take a step back? Or even though I've been told multiple times now to wind to it back. To wind it back. Calm down a little bit. This is a team challenge. No one's going to be like, I'm so glad SJ was really loud and obnoxious. What the hell is going on with your eggs? That's great. Yeah. Now, if I was Pete in this situation, I'd be like, can you shut Can you up? shut off and get away, please? You're distracting me. She, she's almost like she's gonna go in and be like, now give me the camera. Yeah. I want to wear the dress. I've got no interest in talking to you. <laughs> like clapping the most, making the most noise, doing the most. There was one sort of person in the group that sort of tried to take charge. Yes. And I was a bit sort of disappointed with that because we yes. all had some really good ideas. Evicted! The yes. first photo shoot went fantastically well and I didn't think that the second photo shoot was going to have a chance. But now I, I do think they're in the running. Oh. Definitely. Oh! Mysterious women Although on the garment! SJ was pleased with the photo shoot. Oh. The, uh, Although SJ... I thought... SJ's legs were over Rhea's shoulders oh, yeah. then. I was like, oh, oh my yeah. goodness. Oh, oh lesbian. Porn I'm home. actually gay and I'm part of the Daily Mail. The, the Daily, Daily Gay. <laughs> the Daily Lesbian. Yes. The earlier clash with the rest of her team is still playing on oh, her mind. Oh, shut up. I'm upset that I don't like you hearing it. It's all my time. It messes with you. It messes with one of these people. It just messes with you a bit. I've never had to be one of these people. I've never had the best life in all the world, you know. I've done the most successful things that I could have ever dreamt of doing by being nice. What's that got to do with anything? Coming up, the Daily Mail! <laughs> Living! Hates hate, hate. hate Daily Mail! <laughs> It's more than the Daily the Mail. Give it, and the candidates are anxious about the upcoming elimination. We're going to get a cease and desist from the Daily Mail. Yeah, we'll say, we'll stop being transphobic then. I think I'm the only one of the. Demons! Whole demon! Is the Demon Mail! Optimistic about our team winning. Have you ever Stars seen someone like ironing I mean, on a competition reality TV show? If, uh, if our team loses. I'm so glad you said that. About the eliminations. Um, I'm going to be very upset if Ina or I are eliminated because why Debbie, is there, why De is there was there echoing? I that it's really tinny. She's yeah. clearly in like the cupboard yeah. or something. Like just like hello, hello, yeah. Debbie. No one listens to me. No, yeah, yeah. 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 The Daily Mail. I read the Guardian. Yeah, I do. I like the Times. Yeah. but not the Daily Mail. No, 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 that's more interesting. The gays so, are very. Yeah. The gays don't even pay attention. No, no. We weren't able to shine. I'm just hoping that I'm not Denise today. Denise, I girls! I've had it up to here with us. I read that she Lily. She Lily. She Lily. Oh, yes. Donna Cooling to decide Hello. which one of the remaining nine candidates will not become Pete's PA. Oh, here we are, girls. Hi, everyone. Hi, yeah. Um, it's time to find out which one of you is going to die. What it takes to be my PA. And that person will have to leave the house. <laughs> I tried to interpretive dance. <laughs> oh, lovely. Your task was to style me for a magazine photo shoot. So, Rob, how did it all go? Well, I was observing Damon's team and... I was observing was the Daily Mail. So, for example, you know, you didn't do as much blagging, as much discounting. You, you got 10% discount. No but, discount. But for a photo shoot, you know, you should be getting like 50, 60% discounts. Mm. But, you know, when the item was actually on, I don't like what? what are you talking about? You're not talking to a brand like you're just going in some random shops. Yeah. Like if someone came into when I worked in retail, be like, it's for selling poison, can I have this like big case of like drink for free? No, 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 like, pay for it. Yeah. Like, what do you do? It's like contact not, headquarters. They're not and get talking to the PR, PR people. Kid. Yeah. What are we, Weird. That's very this strange. This man who is a business analyst who is also like a doctor. People came for me in the comments when I said like, oh, he's not a real doctor. Is in like, yes, he can have a doctorate, but he's not. This, like, if we were on an airplane and someone said, is there a doctor on board? I wouldn't expect this business analyst to be stand up and say, me, I'm a doctor. Like, I'm the daily that's man. That's not what we're looking for. Do you know what I mean? The fact that he's a business analyst here saying you should have gotten that sixty percent off. Just in someone's reach, like in someone's local Lu shop. Ludicrous. What are you talking about? Weird. Pete managed to work it, made it look really good. Work it, girls. So, do you want to have a look at the photograph? Yeah, I like Let's look at the photograph. Not what even a screen. No. Unveiled at the pageant. 
That's, I hate that's it. That's really, really great. I'm really pleased with that. Great thighs. And, uh, yeah, really, yeah, really legs, strong the, legs. The arms, I right, guess constantly living in high heels. Shape. The colour's mm. great, the composition's great. They've made that I'm nice, fed that up of watching your Pokemon content. Yes, yes, yes die. But ultimately, I don't think that's... <laughs> they could have ironed me as well, but uh, ultimately, I don't think that's important. So I, I actually really did choose great. to cut yeah, yeah, it was me. Really jumps out at you. I'm thrilled with that one. Donna, tell me everything. Well, I was with Ria's team. Right. They did really well. They so far, I actually think the red one might win. But we haven't but seen from that photo. vibe. He was like, I love it. Love it, scale. Flagged loads and of stuff. We had loads of free stuff. Oh, black and we got Down freebies. to Nikki. Yeah, we had loads of money left over. So we bought an extra coffee. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's have a look. <laughs> Whoa, that's, that's really, really, really great. That's fantastic. My criticism of that looking at it is is the green fabric and, and the vase it looks like the vase has fallen over and <laughs> the green fabric looks kind of messy mm. as, a, as a white on white shot with just the red flower as a detail mm -hmm. that would be absolutely great so it's a very tough choice yeah, like, when do you ever look at white and green what, what, what's what's what why did they pick white and green i know they were trying was this live re live live not dead yeah so like no this was dead no it? that was yeah they were dead no, 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 the other one was dead because they were like resurrection, resurrection. resurrection. They were resurrection. alive. But like green and white. Green and white is a very I don't strange know what, color choice. What, 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 what is green and white? I like rusty spoons. I love this hell orb mm. here. Oh, the red one's one. Oh, countdown. Da, da, da. That, that, that I've got pot to makes it look cheap. Winner. It could have gone either way, but ultimately the picture is everything. So, the winner is... Me. The Daily Mail. Damon's team. Oh. Now she's like, I'm so glad I picked, I, I, I picked it. I did it. I'm so glad I read the Daily Mail. <laughs> the kids love me. Okay. Oh my God, I'm very, very tearful. I bet they're fully shocked mm. that they've won that. Right, girls, I've got going to... Sort of um, happiness, really, because obviously I had my heart <laughs> set on the fact that we were going to lose. We won the Sorry, I just tickled my... I have to say, I am absolutely in shock. I'm also in shock, to yeah. be Right, who's gonna get executed? I'm gonna have to eliminate one of you today. Electric chair! Um, now you've got another chance to each individually step forward. Do you know what I have noticed? There's no re. There's no no one saying, like, Pete, you can't say uh, you can't say uh, e, and like stutter in your words. Yeah. You have to re shoot that bit. There's no. None of that. No, I agree. It's really low budget. This is probably one of the lowest budget shows that we've actually watched. Yeah. I can't think of another one that is. I mean, maybe Trini and Susanna, but there's still no, like, ooh. Like, uh, even like. I get that Pete's the in a, a slightly more fancy chair than everyone else because he's like the boss. But like the other chairs are like just really shitty ones that you can just get. It's, yeah, this weird that they're just like sitting in the corner and not even at a table. Yeah, or there's something. no like set. Why is it, yeah? Why is there like, like a huge desk that they can all sit behind or something? Like I get that we're, we're looking at, but even like America's Next Top Model, like the first season, which obviously didn't have a huge budget. They still budget, had a desk. They had like a stuff. desk in front. Like, yeah, it's, to, it's, to give that authority, that corporate feel. This feels very much like they're talking down, like the contestants are talking down to the judges. Yeah, like, it's, it's really very weird. strange. Tell me what why you think you should be my PA. Oh. Okay, Ria. Okay, I know the shot wasn't great. I absolutely know that now seeing it. Um, I didn't want to insult the photographer yesterday by taking- But who picked the pictures? Who chose the pictures? Yeah, there's a few, you could have, I'm sure there was other photos that were nice. Yeah, there. maybe. Looking over and looking through the lens, which is normally what I would be doing. And um, we tried to come up with something creative, which is what we believe that you are. You're an artist. Thank you. And okay. We okay, that's enough. Okay. Oh, <laughs> shut up, cringe. Uh, yeah, um, I tried to work as a team player. I managed to get a few blinds, which is a bonus I that's hope. That's fantastic, really. From this, it, what I'm going to say is that I will learn and I will go on to become a better person because I can't be perfect. A better person. A better person. You're not a bad person for not knowing like fashion. Like kind of being a, a I'm, bad I'm, woman. You are a bad person. A bad woman. I feel like you she's going to go. What, Deb she, yeah, she's too docile. She's very timid, isn't yeah. she? Docile. Yeah, she's <laughs> tranquilized. <laughs> Ketamine. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> You can't cuzzle me! Oh. Stabbed at the pageant! No, I see you read the Daily Mail. I do. Hello. 
Well, I just like to say I felt that we worked really, really hard together. We worked excellently as a Even team. her demeanour is like... Yeah. Um, we did everything we could Just kill me. Mummy. Put me out of my misery. Would you like to wear mummy's wig? No, I want to die. Sex. And um, <laughs> I'd still like to be a PA. <laughs> okay, okay, Debs, thank you. Yes. <laughs> I've built so much confidence from just the beginning to now. I it's just... been like What's a day. This awful, like oh, sideburn thing. That's weird. Isn't what it? is Taking that? it down to there and then having a little gap. But it's also like wonky. Like, what is that? I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't, I, 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 yeah, I choose not to partake in the fashion. It's great. Because he's a bad just, person. Yeah. <laughs> build on that and show you I can do more. Okay, that's great. Thank you. I think. Death now we come going. to the worst part of the day. We're going to put our heads together, and when you come back into the room, you'll. I'm s what like? Oh, look at that! Say something, Belle. What is this? Wow. What, what is that? I mean, I love colour, but this is a bit like. Hello, I've put on every dress I own. Yeah, that is I a could bit make strange. my mind yeah. up. Look at her though. Look, she's like. Oh, Debbie is oh, no. Oh, she's, oh, she's, oh, and she he, he's like, I'm going to die. Yes. Find out which one of you hasn't got the job, and that person will have to leave the room. If the lighting in this room out. is terrible yeah. as well. Yeah. So please leave the room now. Please leave the room please now. Get out. <laughs> get out. Get out. Get out. Uh, oh, I, I just sit on the stairs outside. Everybody worked together, and it's just not fair. It is actually just not fair. It's 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 not It's not unfair. It's not fair. 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 It's not fair you know, round SJ, I don't want to dismember her. But like, well, obviously, first of all, we don't know what Pete's seeing, so Pete's probably not seeing any of that stuff. Yeah, that's but true. But also, her being insufferable isn't actually part of the challenge or part of the rules. Yeah, or part yeah, of, yeah. Like, the, the end goal was to make an outfit. So even if someone's really annoying, it doesn't matter if they're annoying, if the end result is... Yeah, if the end result is exactly what he's asked for, then mm. it doesn't matter how you get there. What matters is that you got there. Yeah. Oh, the music. I found this really tough. Can you help me out here? How do you think Rhea was in this task? Uh, Rhea was great. This this is her forte. This is what she does. She's into photography. She is now torturing herself out into there because she can't believe what huge blunders she, she mm. made. But given that, if you say that photography is her big passion, then surely that makes the mistake even more unforgivable because she really should have known I that she should like have told no. her. I don't like this. No. I don't understand why he's there. Like. I'm really confused. But maybe she felt intimidated by his status. But given that she's already got six years of experience as a celebrity PA, doesn't make doesn't that make it even more unforgivable? You know, people like Debs, Ian, they Debs. don't, and they're learning so much more quickly than she is, it seems. What about Debs? Um, she's she's extremely timid. She has to be led. I'm not sure that she's that. Why is she sitting like that on this stage? All everyone's posture in this is bizarre. I believe so. Yeah. But, but she's lovely. Exactly. As a person, she's why has it got a vignette? Very, very, like, yeah, very, yeah, very, very, very loyal, reliable. <laughs> okay, give me the deal about it. Dark. And the lighting yeah, in the light face is like, really like speaking into the shadows. We only had one torch, yeah, and it was a black light. Eager to learn. What did he do in the? What was his part in this task? Um, they used him as a mannequin because Go. he had no sizes. So he willingly, in the middle of the shop, stripped off and, and put on a boob tube dress. Did he look good in it? He looked fabulous, okay. and, you know. And he wasn't. He didn't bat an eyelid at all. He was perfectly happy. He um, carried that's, everything. I suppose the that's quite commendable flag. for the yeah. time. Well, that it's does kind stand of a painful something. and difficult decision, but common sense gets the better of me, and I think I've made my mind up. Oh, it has, it to, be has Debbie. to be Debbie, right? I love Debbie because she's very sweet, but like, it's you're you're just not going to be able to do it. Here in my hands, <gasps> America's I next top scandal girls. And that person has not been successful. Ria, it's clear that you started off at the top of the pack, but this is the second time in a row. That you've led a losing team. Nikki, your drive, enthusiasm, determination, and courage were admirable. But I'm looking for winners, Ooh. not losers. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> Debbie, your energy, your personality, everything about that you. That shot! Is she was like. Debbie, but on the day of the shoot, you died. I felt that you became a little invisible. She's and that's going. Kind of a let down. On the blood. Ian. I hear you were a great clothes horse and you looked fabulous in a boob tube. But you were lacking a God bit of God save the queen! And, and when I say the queen, we mean me! Because I read the Daily Mail! And this is really, really difficult. But it's a job, not a game. Right. 
Oh. I have in my hand nothing. It's a double eviction. Debbie. Oh, Debbie Dead Wish. Be. Dead. Don't cry, don't cry. Wait, Just to go and get dog sick. <laughs> <laughs> Poor dad. Oh, everyone loves her, see? This is the thing. Mm. Oh, look at the slow-mo. Wistful oh, woman I into the night. Break a PA to oh. somebody. If there's somebody out there who'd like me. Oh! <laughs> Stop me! Debbie! Debbie. Debbie. Which happens to count for a lot, so... That's okay. I'll, I'll find somewhere else where I'm going to. I just feel like she's not cut out for that kind of yeah. work. I just want to say that you all did great on Thank that. So and it's going to get harder for me. We'll get better. Yeah. Okay. All right, now beat it. <laughs> wow, beat it, girls. Die. Get out, Paul. It's time to die. <laughs> See as I. <laughs> sissy! Yeah. Hello. Would you like to see about crocheted thumb? <laughs> With Debbie oh, eliminated, no, we've got a graphic oh, oh, Debbie, Debbie. Debbie. Who will be Pete's PA? I genuinely don't know at this point. We've got lots of episodes to watch. Yeah. Next time. Oh, no, 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 don't stop. give me spoilers, girl. No. I've got some thoughts. I think it was clear that Debbie was going to oh, go yeah, from like was, basically was... the first five minutes of the entire show. I was like, oh, Debbie. You know what's going. funny though? Is like most, I mean, obviously, I guess maybe because it's a bit old, but most reality TV shows now, you can always tell kind of how the episode is going to end because they really put like a story arc and everything. Yeah, yeah. And this whole thing was about. SJ, 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 SJ. Uh, yeah, the way they were editing there's it, there's some yeah. kind of thing and she would like a tantrum at the end and she got evicted. But like, yeah. suddenly someone completely different. Like, completely we never di thought... Who didn't actually make that much of an impact throughout the episode. Yeah. And she was just like, kind of gone. Although people like Debbie are lovely. The fact that she's so like sweet oh, and lovely she was, wouldn't have I, a fly. I think she was absolutely wonderful, but it was, she just, I just don't feel like she's got the... The bold. The commanding kind of energy yeah, to be you need to be a, a bit like ruthless yes. in order to work work it girls yeah and i feel like she didn't have that but the very the her little end section there where she was like i hope someone takes me i was like oh I, 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 I just think could you imagine her trying to negotiate fees yeah like no she'd be like because it works, you need to be you... quite stern for that kind yeah, of stuff because you you, companies would do whatever they can to like fuck you over to get yes. pay you the least amount of money you could never you could you never imagine have, her being like yeah. no we want no more yes more or he's not getting out of bed so deal with it Oh, and that was how Debbie died. <laughs> that was how Debbie. Died. <laughs> I must admit, though, the way that SJ was edited or was behaving actually in this episode was really strange. It's like she was trying to be the star of the show. Yeah, it's like the way she was standing, like whilst everyone else was talking, and then was like, "No, actually, no, no, it wasn't me. It wasn't about me. No, it wasn't no, about me. No, 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 no." But also played the victim immediately. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, I couldn't have someone like that on my team either. I can imagine her in an office and that she's one that everyone hates. Yeah, she's the one that everyone's like, oh God. Oh God, I wish Here she, she Why does she pull a sick Oh, egg? why is she drunk yeah. and shitting in the fountain yeah, at the exactly. Christmas party? Yeah. Oh, but the gays love her. Mm, yes. Let me know what you think about what we've seen in today's episode in the comments box below. And do you read the Daily Mail? The Ma Daily Mail! I am still recovering from surgery, so I shall not be at it yet. We are, we are banned from that. They're banned from the Daily Mail. We cannot, we no, cannot no, keep no, every two no. seconds. But Daily Mail. Well, if she gets evicted soon, we're going to lose our joke. That's <laughs> true. Yes, yeah, so we're Daily okay, Mail. The next round, we, we can make no. sure we do it eight million times. Yes, yeah, yeah, the whole. I've changed episode. my attitude. Yeah. yeah, all every single sentence will just be I read the, the Daily, Daily Mail. The Daily, Daily Mail. Daily Mail. Daily I Mail. read the Daily Mail. Yeah. The gays love. The me gays. Out. The day loves the, the Time for the patrons. You can see yourselves scrolling past the screen right here, my loves. I do actually have Twitch. It is like Saria Plays. However, I am not streaming at the moment because Mummy's recovering mm. from titties. Yeah. So she's getting a uni boob. I am. Yeah. With one large one. Yeah. Over there, Over like there. this. So come and follow me over on Twitch and I will be streaming real soon. And with that, my loves, I also want to say a massive thank you to my top tier Patreon. Aloria, Luke Peterson, Steph Utech, Orko Samoji, Beebles32, Camille Sara, Shell Herman, Christy Crownover, Christina Kyle, Connor, ContraPoints, Danielle, Danny Smith, Dr. A, Elizabeth Stone, Eric Castillo, Jen Martin, Jennebeth Herman, Jenny Hendricks, Caitlin Wright, Catherine Ritter, Laura Jane, Laura Jane again, Les Banana, Lisa Pennington, Min Min TM, Mariah Sherman, Nixie Tricks, Paolo Rivera, Rachel V, Seabiscuit, Ryan Vita, Sexy Texy RN, Slampire Queen, Travafol, Tromo, Victoria, Corella, and Zoe Sevier. And do you know what, my loves? I want to leave it on the notes of. Oh gosh. Um, Debbie, a minus. A minus. Uh, <laughs> oh, yeah, no, very good. Yeah. And with that, I don't genuinely know. 
I just, don't know. No, don't read the Daily Mail. Just don't. Oh, yeah, God, don't read the Daily Mail. No, no, no. 